Yo, Denver, want to shred some gnar? Well, ditch the traffic to the mountains and head on down to Ruby Hill, just off Platte River Drive and Florida Avenue in Southwest Denver. Right behind me here, we have the Ruby Hill Rail Yard. The rail yard is something we build every year in the winter months, usually January, February-ish, and it's a free public terrain park. So Ruby Hill Rail Yard is actually the only urban terrain park in the country and possibly the world. So we work really hard to bring the mountains down to here and it's really unique. Uh, you're not gonna find it anywhere else, so you, it's a must see. Um, and it'll last eight to 10 weeks, so your window of time is limited, so get on down as soon as you can. Working hand in hand with Winter Park, Denver Parks and Recreation works diligently to turn this urban peak into a winter wonderland. Winter Park is a huge supporter of the rail yard. Um, we actually get snow guns from them once they're done using them at the end of December. We bring them down here and as soon as we get that cold weather window, uh, we start blowing snow as fast and as much as we can until we have enough to build out the rail yard. We build out the park and uh, Mother Nature takes over after that and we make it last as long as we can. Open to skiers and boarders of all abilities, the park has something for everyone, even if you don't have your own gear. This year, actually, we have free rentals that we're offering from Denver Parks and Recreation. Uh, we rent out snowboards, so you could come and it's first come, first serve. We do have a limited number of snowboards, but we have sizes everywhere from small to large. So for anybody and everybody, um, you're going to get a snowboard, boots, and a helmet to be able to use. The yard only exists as long as the snow does. So don't wait to carve your way down there. Now, we bring the mountain down to the city, so you don't have to sit in I-70 traffic. You can come down to Ruby Hill, see a terrain park, see snowboarding, whether you're an active snowboarder and skier or you've never done it before, this is a good place to come check it out. For more stories, check out Denver's YouTube page or tune in to denver8.tv.